and welcome to Chess 101. I'm Melanie from Charlotte County Library and History Division and today we will be learning about the history of chess. The history of chess goes back 2,200 years. Here's a brief timeline of the history of chess. In the 16th century, the game Chaturanga, common ancestor of the board games Chess, Shogai, and Jangi, evolved from its current form in India. In the year 600, the Persian game of Shatranj, the direct ancestor of modern chess, was mentioned in writing. In 720, chess spread across the Islamic world from Persia. In the year 840, the earliest surviving chess problems were found. In the late 10th century, dark and light squares were introduced on a chessboard. In 1173, the first recorded use of algebraic chess notation was discovered. In 1283, the earliest collection of chess problems was composed. In the late 13th century, pawns were now able to move two ranks in the first move instead of the usual one move. In the late 14th century, the en passant rule was introduced. In 1422, the rule that stalemate is a draw was introduced. In 1471, the first book to deal solely with chess was published. In 1474, the first chess book in English, called The Game and Play of Chess, was published. Between 1475 and 1525, the modern moves for the queen, bishop, and castling were adopted. In 1497, the first European work on chess openings was published. In 1690, openings were now systematically classified. In 1802, the earliest known American chess book was published. The year 1830 saw the earliest recorded instance of a modern female chess player. In 1851, the first international tournament was held in London. In 1857, the first American Chess Congress one by 20-year-old Paul Morphy, caused a chess epidemic across the United States. In 1867, mechanical game clocks were introduced in tournament play. In 1886, the first official World Chess Championship match was held. The year 1888 saw the first international correspondence tournament. In 1899, chess clocks began to have timeout flags. In the year 1911, the first simultaneous exhibition with more than 100 participants was held. In 1927, the first official chess Olympiad occurred in London. Fun fact, did you know that there is a goddess of chess? Caissa is a Thracian dryad portrayed as the goddess of chess. She first appeared in an epic poem by Vita. She is later mentioned in a poem by William Jones, in which Venus creates the game of chess as a gift for his brother Mars to win the favor of the dryad Caissa, who had originally rebuked him. Let's look at some of the greatest moments in chess history. We'll talk about five. Tamur Griev breaks the Guinness World Record. He broke the blindfold simultaneous exhibition record by playing 48 people at once while riding on an exercise bike. Judith Polger, known to be the strongest female player of all time, she earned the Grandmaster title in 1991 at the age of 15 years, 4 months. She's also the youngest player in the world to achieve this title. And she is the first woman to surpass the 2700 ranking. Gary Kasparov in Deep Blue. Gary Kasparov was the youngest ever world champion of all time at age 21 years, 5 months. In 1996, Gary Kasparov beat Deep Blue, the supercomputer created by IBM, with a score of 4-6, 3 wins, 2 draws, and 1 loss. Mangus Carlsen, a Norwegian grandmaster, is the current world champion. He is a chess prodigy, and he earned the grandmaster title at age 13, 4 months. Robert James Fisher, also known as Bobby Fisher, is an American prodigy and grandmaster. He won the 11th World Chess Ch Championship, and he's the first American world champion. 
I'll leave you with a quote today. Chess is a mind game as well as a board game. Magnus Templar. Thank you all for watching and join us next month for Chess 101 where we talk about terms and vocabulary.